This video highlights the benefits of using CFD modelling over wind tunnel testing for the analysis of wind in the built environment. Engineers, architects, planners and designers must consider the effects of wind. In certain conditions, structures may experience vibrations due to wind. Pedestrians and cyclists in public spaces can be exposed to dangerous wind conditions. Traditionally, wind tunnels have been used to study the interaction between wind, structures, pedestrians and cyclists. However, wind tunnels have several disadvantages. You can't fit an entire structure into a wind tunnel, and so scaled models are used, which can lead to underestimating the true results. The wind tunnel sensors disturb the flow, which can influence the end results. Measurements can only be taken at sensor locations, which must be chosen in advance. It is time consuming and expensive to repeat the wind tunnel test for all necessary wind directions. It is costly to recreate previous wind tunnel tests, where it has been determined that additional testing is needed. Computational fluid dynamics modeling or CFD, can be used as an alternative to wind tunnel testing. CFD has benefited greatly from improved computational power and modelling capacity. There are many reasons to use CFD modelling over wind tunnel testing. CFD models are run at full scale and so do not suffer from scaling issues. There are no physical sensors to influence the measurement. Results are available across the entire domain. Models can be easily adapted and rerun without the drawbacks of scheduling time in a wind tunnel facility. Each of the models analysing different wind directions can be run in parallel simultaneously. Furthermore, CFD modelling facilitates mapping of results in a highly visual and informative way and can easily feed into iterations in the design process by exploring and comparing design options. In summary, CFD is an ideal tool for investigating wind effects, informing the early design stages, exploring and comparing design options, offering high resolution input for regulatory compliance, and analysing the wind environment in a fast and inexpensive manner. I'm Dr. Jennifer Keenahan from the School of Civil Engineering in University College Dublin.